The exhibition that's currently showing in the UOW Gallery is a celebration of the rather eminent artist Guy Warren. It's called Hills and Wings and um, he turned 100 this year and so we wanted to help him to celebrate his 100th birthday and put on an exhibition that honoured not just his work but um, when he was a director of the UOW Art Collection for 10 years, some of the work that he chose for the university and is still part of the art collection. So essentially this is a very large white box, so incredibly high ceiling um, and we had nothing in it. It was just an empty white cube really. What it reduced was our wall space. We didn't really have the running wall space that that the Miller Walls then enabled us to have. We use the Miller Walls to create um, the two spaces. When they arrive at the gallery, they can just see all of Guy's work. And then as they enter the space, they see another little gallery space within the gallery that showcases the other work. We have the 3.5 metre high walls, which are enormous, but actually they're not too enormous because they, they work with the height of the door. And so actually aesthetically, it works really well. So for us, the 3.5, it turned out, was a fantastic selection of size, really. With these Miller walls, we have opportunities um, for future exhibitions to be able to use the electrical pits that we have in the floor and place the walls around these pits so that all the electrical components are all concealed uh, within the walls. Um, and then we're able to show um, video works or install more lighting or, or speakers on top of the walls to be able to have something that is easily movable and reconfigurable for each exhibition is a more cost-effective way for us to go forward.